Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Digimon World. In the last part, we f took care of the rest of Factorial Town, and so now we have a nice big recruitment going on here. Um, in this episode, I'm going to take a little time off from the exploring. Hopefully, it's enough time that Mom and Mom doesn't die on us. But we're going to find out a way to get some nice amount of money. You could have done this at any time after you unlocked medium recoveries in the shop, I just waited till now because, yeah, I don't know, felt like it. Alright, so we have 51 medium recoveries. Let's just go 50 for the sake of easy of um, easy memory of knowing what they are. So 25k worth of medium recoveries. So right there, that's how much we have of medium recoveries. Now we're going to head this way. And we are going to go to Friesland. Yep, the snowy, snowy Friesland. I'm pretty sure Mommy Mon doesn't mind the coldness. Take us to Friesland, please. So, um, oh, to do this, make uh, also gonna say uh, if you want the two th thousand to get to Friesland, remember you have make sure you have that much, and also have an autopilot. Make sure you have an autopilot. You'll see in a bit. Alright, Digit Mushroom, somehow able to survive out in this coldness. And we're heading back down to where we talked to Waymon, basically. You know, with the glacial ice, as I called it. I'm pretty. I don't remember what you would actually call it. Yep, don't want to fight you, Hyogamon. Down here. I'm pretty sure it's this one. And we have a Mojimon here. Remember how I said they're traders? Well, if you talk to him, he will trade a medium medium recovery for a super defense disc. Now, yes. Yeah. So, we're going to be doing this. Over, and over, and over. So, just so I won't bore you guys, I'm going to cut it here, and I will return once we have um, everything sold away. So, be right back. Alright guys, and now I have traded away all of our medium recoveries, and if you take a look, that means he traded us those discs. So now, instead of those re recoveries, we have these super defense discs. Now, the reason I asked, said to bring an autopilot is because sometimes he will not let you move after you talk to him. So, you wouldn't be able to move after you got finished talking to him. But since I'm going to go back to the city anyway, we're going to use our autopilot. And after we use our autopilot, of course, you know what we're probably going to do. We're going to head down here. To the item shop. Go to Patamon. So, now each of those uh, medium recoveries cost 500. And these discs sell for 2,000. So you're times four, multiplying times four your pro, uh, cash style pile. Look at that. Isn't that nice? 100,000 bits. It, 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 it's so much it goes overflows on the bits counter. And so what are we going to do now? Well, of course, we're going to buy all the medium recovers we can. And we still have more bits than we've ever had before. Isn't that amazing? That is that that is the this is the way to make money in the game. You could fight enemies over and over again, 
but this is as long as this is in the game you might as well do this now there is other than the autopilot warning there is one other thing you'll have to watch out for and I will explain that when I come back I'm going to do this a couple times so we have a nice cache of big a uh, nice bit of cash and some items that we could very much use at the moment so until then I am going to pause this and I will be back again for when we have that time well, guys so I think that time. is enough for now I will do it more off screen but uh, I'm gonna quick sell we still have the 51,000 that we had before I'm gonna go down and all the ones I bought before and we're gonna sell them too bad can't go any faster than this but this is what we're gonna do Oh, it's so nice. Look at that number. Look at that number. So yeah, money's not going to be very much of a problem anymore. So let's buy... Max stack of these. Well, let's not do that. Oh, well, I'll do that later off camera, guys. I don't want to waste your time. But what we are going to do... Oh, don't want to sell anymore. We're going to get the Amazing Rod for finally. Alright, so in order to do that, we're just going to keep doing this till we get some good cards. Just going to keep doing this. We're going to get tons of cards. And yeah, this might sound... The sound might get annoying after a while, but that's okay. We're just going to keep doing this. And... Once we get enough cards, we're going to go trade them in. To Gek Shogun Gekkomon, and we are going to get that amazing rod. Hopefully, we'll get a couple one uh, 100 point cards in here. Forget which I I mean, it's mostly the megas and the the the, the, the like the popular ultimates that are in the game that are the 100 cards. I would know it if I saw. Well, I probably wouldn't know it if I saw it, but you know. What's funny is you know I hit all that number. To check how much everything we have, and we still have 235,000. It's ridiculous and ridiculously awesome, though. Mega Seedramon, that one is definitely a 100 point card. The problem is, is you also want to collect, if you're going for all the medals, you want to collect uh, all the cards, and so you don't want to sell your only 100 point card because they are that rare. So I won't be doing that, and just in case I. I don't think I would ever be crazy enough to try to do a uh, all metal run again. That was whew, that was a rough, rough time. King of the Sukumon card. That's also a 100 point. I'm pretty sure. I'll keep doing. I'll do this for another minute, and then we'll. Eh, we got enough time to do it for a little bit longer, and then we'll head on up to Shogun Geckos. Talk to him. We have enough money. We could just use Bergermon transport to go to Misty Trees now. Don't have to worry about that anymore. Oh, another Mega Seedramon. Hell yeah. A whole bunch of these crappy cards, but you know, it's how the cookie crumbles. I had a Miramon card. We could go sell that for 1500 Don't really need that anymore, do we? Huh. <laughs> Don't have to worry about the money. It's so nice. Now we can go and fight to our heart's content. But the reason we want this um, this amazing rod is so we can go somewhere and be able to get recruit a couple of Digimon that will help our town immensely. All right, that should be good. Let's see how much money we still have left. Still tons of money left. Okay, that's one thing I will buy here. Portable potties and autopilot, and I'm still going to buy 99 medium recoveries because if if I'm not going to trade them in, I will definitely at least use them. There we go. See a Patamon. We still have one more. I really remembered this while I was uh, trading. We still have one more item shop guy to unlock. Unless Mojimon is one of them. I don't think he is. But, uh... Yeah. So, 
Mamemon's gonna be getting tired here soon, and we'll be able to actually see what Elekmon does, because I think he doesn't, uh, it doesn't show what he does for the city until night comes out anyway, so. Mamemon should be getting tired. Because as soon as I leave the town, I know he's gonna get tired. Yes, I have. Euromon. Not yet. I'll buy some later. <laughs> Not like I have to worry about money. Alright, we're heading off to uh, Misty Trees, which will be right by Gecko Swamp. Yep, I know. Ah, beautiful music again. Oh, it takes us here. That means we're gonna have to f run our way through Gecko Swamp, or through Misty Tree to get back to Gecko Swamp. Is the m no the mist not back? That's just as misty as the trees. It's without the mist. Up, oh, yep. Mama Mon's not itching for a fight. Ooh, it's misty here, so um, Mama Mon does not like it here. It's gonna rust him. Get him all rusty. We don't want our Digimon pal rusty. Chaos doesn't want rust. I'm surprised I've got through there without getting hit. I usually like 500 times before, you know. Alright. Volume Villa. And now he's tired. Go to sleep, my mommy man, and please do not die. I want you to live just a little bit longer. Looks like you got a problem about the costume, right? Oh yeah, this is him talking about it more. Don't underestimate me. Numamon will be able to wear it. Shocked? Not only that, once he wears it, you won't believe it. We'll try it. So yeah, that's still us talking about we need to get a Numamon for that, which... I, I don't know if I want to do that in the next one, because he will not stay in Numamon forever, but uh, you, you'll see. Alright, show a Digimon card. We have one second we see Dramon. One extra, I should say. Mega Dramon. Cancel. I don't want to give away my only one. Tyranimon. Capitarimon. Another Capitarimon. Bergamon. These lots of 10 point ones are going to add up after a while, but. The 1 point ones really aren't worth it, though, at all. Leomon. Eh, getting down to the common ones. That's not really worth that. I did not want to talk to you. It is 300 points for the amazing route, right? Yeah, 300 points. All right, just gotta buy a few more cards. Although I guess, hmm, I wonder if going to Factorial Town would be a faster route. Nah, Misty Trees is still faster. Not cheaper, but, you know, money's not too much of a problem. We get to see the town at night now. See? Town at night. What do you think? I turned on the light. Bright enough? Let's make our city clean and cheerful. 
So now we have electricity! Yay, the town is flourishing! Alright, some hope for some good cards here. Gatsumon's okay, I guess. Frigimon's a good one. Brushiomon's a good one. Leomon, obviously a good one. Tyranomon. Um, Gardramon's a good one. Don't think I had him before, though. Demi Miramon, not very good. I s keep thinking Miramon, but you forget there's Demi Miramon, too. Um, Nanimon, I'm pretty sure he's common. Debimon's a good one. Penguinmon, Yanmon. Shogun Geckomon. I'm pretty sure he's a, uh... Ooh, did I, was that a Metal Miramon? Hmm. Like, some of the card Digimon that are on the cards aren't in the game, and that's why when you see them, you're like, what? What? Garurumon's a pretty good one. Florizumon's okay. Centaurumon's okay. I'm just going until I see a 100 point card that I know is a 100 point card. And hopefully one I haven't got before. Waymon, I'm pretty sure it's just 10 point. Maybe a 30 point. Oh, nothing good in here. Monochromon's okay. Shellmon's okay. Keep it going. This this um vending machine is making a killing off these cards. Tankmon, Mojamon. Tankmon will give me thirty points, I'm pretty sure. Centaurumon. Come on, turn him on, way on. Ooh, another way on. A little bit more, guys. Just hold on. I'm just waiting for one more good card to catch my eye. One more good card. Come on, card machine. Give me something good. Erdermon, son, you don't see very often. I'm not going to call it quit on Erdermon, though. Maybe I should have, though. I want to stand... Oh, Monzemon. Right there is probably going to be as good as I'm going to get. So, uh... One more card that isn't one of these usual ones, and I uh, will be done for now. Waru Monzimon, that one's a 100 point card. Too bad it's gonna be my first one. Alright, back to Misty Trees, and then back to Shogun Gecko Mon. Oh, let's also see what a. Nah, I'll save that for next time, don't worry about it. Birdermon. Please take me to Misty Trees. Thank you, boy. Doo doo. Ooh, it's the night music. Oh my god, I love this music, and even at night, it's great. Oh shit, I didn't expect a fight, and I'm already going low on time here, guys. I don't want to make- eh, fuck it. Don't want to make a 20 minute video, but I will if I have to. I think you can learn some air attacks. Luckily, these guys are weak as fuck. We're so used to how strong them- 
uh, HP wise how strong the other enemies were and these guys are freaking lightweights that attack is still pretty dangerous though I bet I can't learn that attack. It must be a fire attack and not a uh, machine attack like I thought it was. Haha. <laughs> oh boy. Dude. Oh, that sucked. You're not gonna like this much, um... I forget what there's... Saber Dramon. Dynamite kick. Get him. There you go, good job. Good job. That was weird. Had a weird glitch there. It's weird seeing 130k bits on that screen. But oh, so feels oh so right though. I know you don't like it here. I'm not trying to shorten your lifespan. I just we gotta run through here, boy. Just relax, and we will make it through okay. Sukaimon are here. And here we are at a Gecko Swamp. And trade in some of those lovely cards. Geckomon here at night, huh? We haven't fought any of those. I'm hoping these uh, I'm hoping this video that's it's getting over twenty minutes. I'm hoping people don't mind too much that they're getting long that th this one or longer I try not to make it uh, long ones too often yeah cuz it's hard to understand which one you want you know well oh, that Shogun Gecko Mon was of course a 100 point card so was the Monze Mon Metal Mon one but they're all not doubled sadly Renamon. Ah, oh, it's only a 10-pointer. Hopefully I have enough 10-pointers to make it through. Looks like I might. Because I remember some Gar... Um... Well, shit. I was going to say Garurumons, but right there were the Garurumons. Waymon. Only need four more. Come on. Sweet. This will be enough. Yay! Also, and now we can buy our amazing rod. Also, I was going to take a... I didn't see what he said, but... There's our amazing rod, and I was going to show you the cards we got. So we have most of the common ones. And here are the rare ones. Oh, so pretty. And here's Metal Mom, my mom. So yeah, we got that. There's our medals. We haven't gotten any yet. And there's my player in all my chart. There's the Digivolution chart. Starting to fill up on the uh, this side at least. On the next side, we'll get even more, you know. But now that we got the amazing round, we can do something next time. So this will be very nice. So next time, guys, we will use the amazing rod and we will fish up a monster. So I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.